What's up? What's up? Jimmy Evans here. Another car video. Topic of this video is why men shouldn't lie to women. Before I get into this topic, just want to let you all know. Uh, first, welcome, uh, welcome to my my video here. Welcome to the channel. The channel's all about helping both men and women be the best they can be in all aspects of their lives, dating, relationships, health, wealth, mindsets, and all that good stuff. And I just want men to be, and women to be the best versions of themselves so we can help make this world a better place. So welcome. And uh, congratulations on getting on that journey. In addition, of course, for those of you who are new, uh, welcome. For those of you who are returning uh, viewers, welcome as well. If you haven't done so, definitely like the video if you want to subscribe, if you want to help me out. Um, if you just like my videos, you want to support me, definitely like, and of course, subscribe, hit the notification button and share the video as well. All that will be very good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So uh, outside of that, let us get back to the video uh, uh, topic. And let us discuss it. So, why men shouldn't lie to women? This is a very important topic because some men feel like, oh, women lie and women do this. So men should be able to do this. And you can tell what kind of men those are. And uh, those are not men you want to be associated with women. And those are not the type of men you want to be men So who are watching. Because those men are not... Um, strong men those those are weak men you know so uh, i'm going to go into this uh, and explain how come men shouldn't uh, lie to women give you the four tips and four reasons i guess more than anything and of course the bonus at the end so you're going to want to stick around to the bonus so you could really understand why men shouldn't lie to women and so you don't do it and so you're better off for it so let us get into the reasons. First and foremost, it puts women on a pedestal. So for you to lie to someone, you have to have so much value in them that you do not want whatever the truth may be to cause a rift between you and them, or you don't want whatever consequence may happen because you are truthful to them you know so that is very 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 powerful because you're obviously saying that whoever you you are lying to is on a pedestal and in this case a woman they have so much more power or they have so much more value in your mind that you don't want to cause whatever uh trouble may happen so um that is the most obvious thing when you lie to anybody, but especially a woman or you know a woman you're dealing with, you put them on a pedestal. You see them as higher than you, and because you see that, your value automatically drops. Because if you didn't see them that way, you wouldn't have uh, been afraid to lie to them. And I get it. There's little lies and big lies, but at the end of the day, whatever you're, you're even if it's their feelings, you put their feelings on a pedestal. You know what I mean? And because you do that, that will always be a handicap. Any Kedra, always be a handicap. Apologize. But yes, that will always be a handicap for you. And it will always uh, hold you back until you get rid of it. It's my bad. I had to get that out of my mouth. <sighs> but um, <laughs> that's the first thing. You put women on the pedestal when you lie to them. Second, it shows fear of women. Because again, if you're putting the woman on the pedestal, now you have a fear of whatever consequence may happen. You say, oh, it's not the woman, it's the consequence. But at the end of the day, it's the woman that will give you the consequence. Whether she'll nag you, whether she'll break up with you, whether she'll... Um, you know, do it back, do it revenge, whatever, you know, uh, you might have done to her and you lied about. She might do it back. 
whatever it is you're showing fear and you're having that fear and it will always be there in the relationship even if you cheated it is best to get it out and suffer the consequences because it shows that you're not afraid and that is the key women want to see they want to see that you're not afraid they want to know that you will be okay regardless you know what I mean? They don't want you to be shaken. You know, you don't have to talk too much. Your actions will speak. When you are more confident, they will be more confident. They will be more receptive. You know? And even if they do something that you didn't like, that might have been manipulative, a lie. You know? At the end of the day, you got to be honest and open about it and suffer whatever uh, consequence may, may, may come. You know what I mean? That confidence will really help you out throughout the relationship. And that lack of fear will really help you out throughout the relationship because it will set the tone and you will be the leader from then on. All right. Number three. Number three is why you should not be lying to women. It destroys trust. And this is a very simple one. In a relationship, regardless if you're in, if you're in a committed relationship, you're your fuck buddies, your friends with benefits, your marriage, it doesn't matter. You don't want to destroy trust. You don't want to destroy trust because if you destroy, when you destroy trust, your relationship is doomed. If you are with somebody who is confident, if you're with someone who is confident, they're gonna leave the relationship. But if you're someone with who is not confident, the relationship will only be worse. The relationship will only be worse. You know what I mean? So, either way, destroying trust is bad when you when it comes to dealing with women. Things will not be good. You know what I mean? Unless if you're in an open relationship and, you know, um, but even then, even if you lie about little things, all that stuff is not good. Lying is not good, period. You don't want to be lying. You know what I mean? You don't want to be lying. Lying is never good. And it destroys trust. It causes, you know, um, unnecessary stuff. Um, and trust is very important because you want to be able to trust the person you're with. And the person who is with you has to be able to trust you. And when that's gone, the regardless, the relationship will be worse for it. So, so if you've made it this far, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you for being here. Uh, definitely uh, subscribe, hit that notification button, and share the video if you're enjoying it. So uh, thank you again. I appreciate it. And let us continue on with the video. So ultimately, um, number four reason you shouldn't lie to women is it causes extra hassle. Because just like uh, the third point, if your woman doesn't trust you, then she's going to be start nagging you about where you're at. She's going to start nagging you about telling the truth. She's going to start nagging you about um, what you're saying um, and whether she tried to contradict you. And you don't want those problems. No confident, strong, happy, positive person wants those problems. You know what I mean? And women are big on that. They're going to always test you. Excuse me. They're going to always test you to see if you're telling the truth. Especially if they know you've lied to them in the past. <laughs> Excuse me. So that's the reason it is always easier and best to stay honest. Because if you don't, you're going to have all the extra drama that comes with uh, people who lie. And you don't want that. We want drama free zone. We want to be having a happy, positive, successful life. Not insecure, drama, negative, you know what I mean? Uh, troublesome life. Or you have to be constantly nagged and bothered about everything you say or do. You know? So, definitely, that's a big one. Causes extra hassle with women. That you just don't want if you want a happy life. So, yes. I'm glad we made it to the end here. We've made it to the end of the video with the bonus. The bonus. And this is the most important one. So, I'm glad you've made it. So this is very important because at the end of the day, 
this is the core when it comes to men who lie and the reason they do it. And if you don't do this, then it obviously means you don't have to, you're not dealing with this thing here. And ultimately it is a lack of confidence. Men who lie to women lack confidence. They do not feel good about themselves. They're insecure. They are not willing to face the drama that is necessary in order to move forward in a productive, positive manner. So they rather lie because, again, lack of fear and all the other stuff. Or because of fear, rather, because of fear of the woman and putting the woman on the pedestal, they lack the confidence. Because if they had more confidence, they wouldn't put that woman on the pedestal. They would definitely 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 uh, be honest and open and suffer whatever the consequence may be and what they don't understand is their woman sure the woman may leave them they may not trust them they may or they may uh, uh, have to suffer some sort of consequence but the woman will respect them and that's what they don't understand and that's because of their lack of confidence so that is the bonus lack of confidence that's the reason men who lied to women, lie to women because they lack the confidence. So yes, thank y'all for making it to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed my, my list and everything. Definitely let me know uh, whether you enjoyed it or you didn't. Let me know if you think I missed anything. Let me know if you think I hit everything spot on. Definitely let me know. I definitely appreciate it. And I always uh, appreciate the comments. Just be respectful. Um, um, outside of that, I appreciate y'all. Um, let me know what other comments you want me to, or let, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. <sighs> Apologize, my mind, my mouth, I kind of blah, 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 two different places. Of course, if you have any, if you found value in this video, definitely donations are always welcome. Donations are always welcome. You know, I want to definitely bring you some higher quality videos. Donations will help me do so. Uh, of course, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button, and share the video so we can get this video out to more people who need them so we can have help make relationships better in the world a better place so outside of that i hope y'all stay safe stay sane and keep on thriving and profiling on these peoples you know and of course always remember the strongest person is the happiest person